We're leaving Cusco for a couple of days. This weekend we are going to Machu Picchu. So our first step in doing so is getting on a train this morning and head to Aguas Calientes. It is currently 5.30 in the morning. Train is leaving around six, so we have to go. Super exciting. Enjoy the view. which is unfortunate. Our seats are great. My hair is literally crazy. Now we get to ride on this train. How exciting. We moved to a bigger table and we got our service. We get a drink and some snacks with our ticket. We've been up for hours. <laughs> So we ordered drinks on the train, but then we just realized it's only 10 a.m. <laughs> Welcome to Machu Picchu, aka Aguas Calientes. Wow. We have arrived at Aguas Calientes, but it's actually not called Aguas Calientes anymore. It's just called Machu Picchu Pueblo because, I don't know, they changed the name. Anyway, we're here. We're probably gonna get some lunch soon, explore the city. It's only bathroom. It's only 11:30 a.m. So we got the whole day. God dang, let's think of the tile. We're here the whole day, so we'll explore the city, and then tomorrow we go to Machu Picchu. Let's get ready to explore. breakfast and then we have to catch the bus. Gotta go to Machu Picchu. Machu Picchu day. It's slightly raining, which is concerning. I think we'll be okay. Got our rain jackets on. Here we go. Our plan is that we're going to chill until the clouds clear and then try to get a view. Okay, what a lovely day to see. Oh. <laughs> what a lovely day. It's raining a little bit. Not an ideal day at all. We're making the best of it. It's, it stopped raining a little bit. It's like drizzling but a lot of drizzling hopefully in the next hour it'll clear up just a bit but we're making our way in and i already see llamas it pretty much stopped raining with our ticket we got entrance to Inca Bridge. 
So we're hiking up there and hopefully by the time we come back down, it'll be a bit sunnier. It's definitely clearing up a little bit very slowly. So we'll see. Foggy, foggy, but it's better than rain. Really hoping we can get back to the overlook spot and get a good view. <laughs> very cloudy still. Yep, very cloudy. Machu Picchu complete! Machu Picchu was absolutely stunning. It was super fun, very beautiful. We are very grateful that the weather cleared up. So we're just gonna sit here and kill some time. We came back to our hotel. They let us sit here. Yeah. And now we're planning our trip to Canada. How exciting. Yes. We still yeah. have... Not that long, two hours. Two and a half hours to get till we have to go to the train. Train's running a little late. Everybody's going crazy out there. But we made it. So we will be on our way back to Cusco. Okay, hi. Uh, we are back in Cusco now. We had a wonderful weekend at Machu Picchu. It was very beautiful, a crazy thing to see. I'm so glad the weather cleared up for us because the beginning was not looking good. But it ended up being a great weekend. I'm not an expert on Machu Picchu, but I will explain what I know and the information that I gathered when I was planning the trip. This is just the basics of what I know. To get to Machu Picchu, your first step is to get to Cusco. The flights are the quickest way, so that's what we did. We flew into Cusco, and then you have to take a train from Cusco to Aguas Calientes. It's about a four-hour train ride. When I booked it, I originally had it a direct train ride from Cusco to Aguas Calientes, but I guess something happened. We ended up having to take a bus for the first two hours and then a train on the way there, which was kind of annoying, but the train tickets are pretty expensive, I will not lie, so. Anyway, once you get to Aguas Calientes, what we did, we spent the night. Um, it was just easier because it's such a long ways to get there. To fit it all in one day is definitely possible, but we just took our time with it. We spent the night. The town is very cute. It's very small, very walkable, but it's nice. Then you have to take a bus to Machu Picchu. It's about a 20 minute bus ride, not too bad. So that's pretty much how we got to Machu Picchu. As you saw, the weather was very bad when we got there. Um, we chose a 6 a.m. ticket thinking that we would like beat the crowds or just be the first ones there, but the weather was actually worse. When we went, it was the end of October, so it is rainy season in Peru. Luckily, it cleared up for us when the sun came out. We ended up doing circuit two, and we also added the Inca Bridge. It was no additional cost to add the Inca Bridge for us, but overall, it was very amazing. I'm so glad that we got to see it. But now we're just back in Cusco for a couple days and we're gonna head back to Lima for one night until we're done with Peru. It has been an incredible trip. 
Our next stop is Canada. We're going to Canada for two weeks. We're gonna fly into Calgary and we're going to Banff. So it's gonna be freezing, but hopefully very exciting and fun. But yeah, that's about it for our Peru, Peru series. I will miss Peru. It was definitely one of my favorites favorite places I've been. It was incredible. Machu Picchu was incredible. Hopefully you liked this video. Thank you for watching and I guess I'll see you in Canada.